Welcome back to Pokemon Soul Silver. In the last episode, we defeated the Viridian City Gym Leader Blue. And now we are heading back to Professor Oak's place. Hello, Professor Oak. Good to see you. This is what I've wanted to give to you. HM08. Excuse me. We're getting HMs this late? That hidden machine contains the move Rock Climb. When you teach it to a Pokemon, you can go up rock walls that have been uh, that have steps carved in them. Those badges are Wow! You've not only become the Johto champion, but you've collected all the Kanto badges. Well done! Hmm. No wonder I sensed something in you when we met. Tell you what, artists. I'll make arrangements so you can go to Mount Silver. Mount Silver is a big mountain that is home to many wild Pokemon. It's too dangerous for your average trainer, so it's off limits. But we can make an exception in your case, Ardis. Go to the Pokemon League reception gate. You can reach Mount Silver from there. Cool! So now we can go to a new place now that we have all the gym badges. That's awesome! But also, more importantly, well... Just as importantly, we'll say that, uh, we have Rock Climb now, which means we can go to a ton of places that we couldn't otherwise. So, uh, <laughs> I guess I'll have to go back to the Pokemon Center to get a Pokemon that can climb, and also a Pokemon that can fly. Dang it. Alright, so let's take a look at Rock Climb. A charging attack that may also leave the foe confused. It can be used to scale rocky walls. It has 90 power and 85 accuracy and has a chance of uh, confusing the foe. I, I think this is a really good move. However, I don't want to get rid of any of the moves that my Pokemon can that my Pokemon currently do know because they're just too good. So I, uh, so I have Giratina out so I can teach Rock Climb and also so I can teach it Fly so I don't, so I'm not taking up two slots. I guess I should have went other way for Fly. Oops. <laughs> because Giratina can learn both Fly and Rock, uh, rock Climb. So, uh, first off, we're going to be hitting up a few places that can that you can use Rock Climb at, and then we'll go from there. Okay, I just wanted to have Giratina behind us, just following us all the way to Diglett's Cave, because it's awesome that you can have any Pokemon following you, including if they're legendary or not. Okay. Uh, but because it's level one, uh, yeah, we're not gonna be doing. We're not gonna be having him out front. All right, so we're in Diglett's Cave today because there are a bunch of places that you can use rock climb on. Now the rock climb surfaces are these. If you, uh, we've seen these quite a few in quite a few places throughout Kanto and Johto, and we're gonna be getting a ton of items from these. And there's actually, there's there's so much in Diglett's cave alone, it's ridiculous. Um, okay, so I guess I go, wait, is there a hidden item here? There has to be a hidden item here, right? Yeah. What is this? Calcium, oh. That's a letdown. Use rock climb on this wall. Get me up there. Are there any more items in here? I, th I'm, I'm thinking there are hidden items that use the dowsing machine. On there's an item down there. Cool. Okay, what's this? Rock incense. All right, now this this is important. Uh, for something later. I'm not gonna be going into it until uh. Wait later, but now we have it, so we can do something with it later. If you do not know what I mean, uh, just 
Stay tuned. <laughs> okay, now I actually really want that item that I apparently missed on the first pass through here. All right, where is this stupid item? <laughs> where is it? Uh, there. Max five. Yeah, that's kind of important to grab. Jeez. Okay. And I believe there's no more items in Diglett's Cave, so we're done here. Alright, so over here on Route 39. On Route 39, there's a rock wall here. Right here. Hopefully there isn't like a rock smash rock as well. That would be the worst news. What do you want? To battle, please. Oh! Oh, actually. Okay. No complaints. <laughs> Good. Wait. Wait, where is this item? Oh, it's up there somewhere. Okay. Uh, we'll check that out in a minute. Now what's this? Lax incense. Now that is used to get Munchlax when trying to breed Snorlax. You just put it on a Snorlax and then breed it, and then you have Munchlax. It's a baby Pokemon. HP up. Ooh. That's neato. And now there is one final minor place that we can use Rock Climb that I can think of at the moment. Oh, it's a rare candy. That's actually super useful. At this point in the game, anyways. All right, so, um... So there are more places to use Rock Climb, but there, there's sort of major places to use them at. Like, it's hard to explain it without, like, uh, being there, but one of the two places we're going to right now. All right, so we are out Mount Mortar today, and already we see a Rock Climb wall. Let's use a super repel. Maybe we'll go through those faster than I thought we would. Who knows? Uh, where did where does these even go? Oh, hey, what's this? A revive. Ooh, that's neat. Whoa, where is this? I don't remember this place. What is this item up here? I I actually don't remember what this is. Dubious disc. Ah, now that, that is an item to evolve Porygon 2 into a new Pokemon. All right, so, uh, I, honestly, I don't know what else is in here. I mean, there's obviously stuff. I just don't remember what exactly it is. I just realized I made a fatal error in bringing six Pokemon instead of five. Hmm. Oh, oh, this is where, oh, okay. So I have been up there before, but because I didn't have rock climb, I couldn't go down here and get this item. Yeah, 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 the stupid feature that you can't, like, have it automatically go hasn't been invented yet. Full incense. Wait. Oh, maybe maybe the Lax Incense was for Wobbuffet to get Why Not, and then this is for Snorlax to get Munchlax? That might be it. Okay. Well, in any case, oops. Because I misspoke. All right, what's this? A nugget? Ooh. <laughs> All right, so there is 
definitely more stuff in here. I just don't remember where everything is and what is all in here. So if we're jumping around, uh, yeah, excuse the jumping around and stuff. Oh, oh, I need to use that rock wall. What is this? Ultra ball, ooh, that's nice. I could always use more ultra balls. Mm. Uh. Where's this hidden item? Is it on this rock wall? I don't think it is. Oh, there's an item up there I wanted. Okay, but what's down here? I'm super confused. What is this? Whatever this is. Oh, hey. Protector. That is used to get right, right on into Rhyperior. So many evolution things in Mount Mortar. Uh, that, uh, that's also considered an evolution thing since Pokemon, many, many, many Pokemon evolve through level up. Wait, where is this item? There's another item. Is it this way? It is. I didn't bring strength. Okay, well, I can teach that. I can teach that very easily. Where are you, strength? There you are. No! Poof. Okay, so this is the wrong side of here anyways. Ah, dang it. Wait, there's a guy up here. Hello? Did I battle you? Oh, I did battle you. Well, that's a letdown. Okay, whatever this item is, it's right down here. Max Repel. <laughs> well, that was not worth my time at all. But at least I'm still up here so I can explore these parts. Alright, I think I got everything from the sides that I can get without going in the middle. So let's go in the middle. All right, the middle cave, which is actually different. Now I, yeah, 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 it has to be up the waterfall because we already went in the basement when we were here last time and I believe we got everything. But what we couldn't do before was use waterfall as well as use rock climb. All right, so what is actually up here? Game, what have you done? What has science done? Okay, there's a hidden item somewhere, but also a trainer. No! Hello! Hi! Yo, Marcus! What? Who's Marcus? Maybe one of the trainers back in the beginning? Oh, hey, you're the trainer that the person was talking about that uses a Seedra. Okay, Giga Drain. <laughs> Sorry to absolutely destroy your Pokemon because uh, type advantages and stuff. Thanks for the free money, though. Oops, I mixed you up. I came to explore Mount Mortar but I got separated from my partner. Did you run to a trainer who uses a slowpoke? That slowpoke is really good at using strength. Uh, yeah, but that was like ages ago. 
It's too bad there's not, like, some kind of side quest that you can do with them, like, actually reuniting them. Because that would be actually kind of cool. And they give you TM and, or something. Maybe a bunch of rare candies. It's too bad they don't do that, though. Alright, so where is this item? Uh, Hyper Potion. That's nice, I guess. Oh, hey, there's an item up there. What's this? Max Potion. Ooh. We're getting all kinds of good healing stuff in here. I wonder if we'll ever need it. Spoilers, probably. <laughs> All right, uh, there's so much surfing and so much getting on and off of your Pokemon, and... Yeah, <laughs> don't really have a lot other, a lot of other stuff to say other than, than that. Okay, so there's an item here. Full restore, ooh. Yeah, so much healing stuff, jeez. It's like they were expecting you to get into a, a giant epic fight or something. Ah! I swear, by the time we're done with Mount Mortar, we're going to be out of super repels again. Jeez. Oh. I can at least get this item. It's an HP up. Cool. Oh, wait, how do you... Oh, you surf. Man, there's so much back and forth in this cave. Like, you go all the way to the right, and then to the left, and all the way to the right, and up, and down, and back and forth. I want that item. I don't care what it is. Actually, I do care. What is it? Ooh, Aerial Ace. Too bad we already taught... Uh, Airheart, a really good flying type move. Air Slash. Otherwise, I probably would have taught her it. Although, uh, more than just flying types can learn Aerial Ace. It's just Aerial Ace, uh, flying types are the most prominent type. Okay, it has to be up there, that item that's dinging. All right, then we're going all the way to the right, and then all the way to the left, and up, and up, and up. All right, what's this? Ah! No, I was going to use a super repel after I got the item, stupid machoke. Get out of here. An escape rope. Cool. Glad I ran into a machoke for that. Okay. Here's some more water that we surf across for like three steps and then we get off and then we have to get on the Pokemon again. Or pull out the item finder. Full heal. Man, they gave you so much healing stuff here. What the heck? And elixir. Okay, there's still one more item over here. Wait. Oh, uh, you go up. Oh, uh, wait. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> I thought there was a rocky wall or something there that you couldn't get past. And I was going to be confused. Dragon Scale. That is used to you to evolve uh, Seedra into Kingdra, which is neato. But also, uh, it's kind of... It's kind of annoying that there are so many trade Pokemon that you trade with held items to evolve them. Because it's just kind of frustrating to get enough friends or systems to trade all that stuff. And, and yeah, you're likely not even going to use a ton of the Pokemon on your team because they're so aggravating to evolve. Iron. Eh.
Okay, there's a hidden item right here. An ether. Okay, there's one more item over there. I need to go up and around. There's so many twists and turns in Mount Mortar. Iron Ball. That is just a base, just a really heavy ball. And if you, it's something I like to do is if you have a Pokemon that can learn Fling, you have it hold that item and then you use Fling and it does a lot of damage. Because it's so heavy and the heavier and the heavier an item is that's being flung, the more damage it does. I went the wrong way. Uh, what's this item? Ooh, Max Revive. You can't buy those, except you can buy, like, an herb version of that. Called the Revival Herb. Kind of an apt name, considering. Max Revive, another one. Jeez, they're so... They're just handing them out like candy in Mount Mortar. Good lord. Is there anything... Ooh. We'll come back to that. Hello? Hey, I'm the Karate King. I train here... I train alone here in this cave. You battle with me! Hooah! Oh boy! Okay, so okay. Hitmon Lee. Uh let's use Air Slash. Same type of attack bonus is gonna murder you. Oh yeah, yeah, it's it's level 34, so yeah, it's Definitely gonna destroy them. Just absolutely massacre. And then Hitmonchan, uh, same thing. <laughs> Ooh, va vacuum wave. Basically, that's a fighting type. Quick attack. That's basically all I have to say about vacuum wave. I don't think a lot of Pokemon learn that. Anyways. Oh, I've been beaten. I'm... I'm crushed. My training is still not enough. But a loss is a loss, I admit it. As proof uh, that you defeated me, I'll give you a rare fighting-type Pokémon. You have no room in your party, so you have to go all the way back to the Pokémon Center and then come all the way back here. I'll just tell you what it is. It's Tyrogue. You can evolve it into three different Pokémon. Hitmonchan, Hitmontop, and Hitmonlee. Each one is specialized in a different stat. Hitmonchan is specialized in defense. Hitmonlee is specialized in attack. And Hitmontop is a balance of the three. So yeah, come back. <laughs> come here with five Pokemon, not six, like I foolishly did. Honestly, I should have just exchanged Pokemon, like... Before I came in here because I realized it like at the very beginning but I was like eh I, I don't need to actually grab Tyrogue okay so wait that this is the basement this is totally the basement how do you get those items at the on the floor up above the like how yeah, this is totally the basement that we've been in before. And also, I missed that item. I guess it's kind of okay that we came back here. But how do you get those, those items? I did not mean to go back down. Huh. Apparently, I got all the items. I thought for sure that... Uh, that one area with all the ups and downs and ups and downs was not on the first floor where that one item I passed a billion times was and the, the hidden thing. 
Okay, well now I feel a lot better. Jeez. Jeez. Okay, okay, okay. Well, I guess we have everything. That's nice. But that also means we can end the episode, I guess. Uh, so... In between episodes, I'm going to be up... Uh, I'm going to be leveling up my Pokemon. I guess we'll go to the National Park. Maybe. Alright, so, uh, next episode on Pokemon Soul Silver, we'll... Honestly, I do not know. Because there is... While we have done a lot, there is still a, quite a bit left. But yeah, uh, in between episodes, I'm gonna I'm going to be up uh, not ugh, wow words. I'm going to be leveling up my Pokemon in between episodes using various trainers all all across Kanto and Johto. And I'll see you next time for more Pokemon Soul Silver. See you then. Oh um, no! What do you want, Anthony? Please tell me you want a battle. Oh, okay, cool. So yeah, anyways, yeah, I'll see you next time.